April 20th is going to be absolutely huge. Okay. Yes, yes, it is going to be one of uh, the biggest fights of the year. Uh, I think I think that beyond being the biggest fight of the year, this is what this is just from a, a guy who doesn't know a lot. Uh, that I think that you are bringing back the uh, the glory to boxing itself. You know what I mean? Boxing since the days I was t- I was just telling my daughter here. My da- this is my daughter Jackie. Hi. Hey Jackie. Um, yeah. That that. Um, you know, in the days of when Tyson was in his glory or when uh, Oscar, who is the promoter of, uh, is he, would he be considered your manager too? Is he your manager? Uh, mostly promoter, he's, he's my promoter. Oscar De La Hoya, those were, those were names when boxing matches, I would go to the MGM or you're gonna be in New York and, and people would fly in from all over the world and every age and people from business and people from show business and it became really big. And it, it seems to boxing in the last decade or so lost its excitement and now you seem to be bringing back the excitement. I think that uh, you know UFC and MMA kinda is, you're fighting with that sport, you know? Yeah, yeah, no, 100%, you know, boxing uh, lost its steam. And that was one of the main reasons why uh, I accepted the fight with uh, Javante Davis under the conditions that uh, that I had to accept because boxing was just in a place where everybody was, uh, I don't know, it was, it was boring. I mean, for lack of better words, it was boring. Nobody wanted to step up and uh, give the fans what they wanted. And uh, I just never had that type of mindset. And uh, now I'm doing it again this time around. Um, but this time I'm, I'm not, you know, dehydrated or under any of those uh, stipulations that they made me last time. Do you, go ahead. Do you think it's because, you know, I we were just talking about this before. Now there's boxing matches like the Jake Paul against Tyson, but it's not, they have their own set of rules. It doesn't really feel like real boxing. It just feels like a, you know, yeah, or publicity stunt almost. And so it's not the same as what it used to be or what you're doing. Yeah, no, hundred percent. It's not, uh, it's not, it's not authentic. I mean, it's not as pure as, you know, what I do, but it does have, you know, obviously uh, boxing, in it, I mean, they're they're throwing punches and, and they're trying to knock each other out. So you could um, you got to give credit to that. But um, I mean, Tyson's almost sixty. Jake Paul's, I believe, yeah, half his age or whatever how old he is. And, and uh, you know, it doesn't it doesn't get me excited. But uh, if it gets other people excited, um, you think that's good for this sport? I mean, it can be. Uh, it just matters on what we do. Um, as real fighters and people who dedicate their life to this and try to climb up, you know, the ladder. Um, if we give the fans what they want, if we don't, then it could be bad for boxing because everybody will be looking forward to those type of fights instead of the fights, you know, in the sport. 